2. Different continent. Home of the two grazing giants. Known for their immense and powerful body structure. In the realm of whispers and tales, they are called Titans of the Wild. Allow us to guide you to the most enchanting corner of our planet, the abode of this exquisite creature. The hills of southern parts of India. This vast expanse stands as the primary grazing and breeding ground for the Indian Gaul, showcasing the true magnitude of their habitat. Apart from India, the map reveals the presence of the Gaul, or Indian bison, in several other countries across the South and Southeast Asian region. The Indian Gaul, a formidable bovid, boasts a robust and muscular physique, crowned by a distinctive convex ridge on its forehead. The Indian Gaul possesses gracefully curved and pointed horns, a feature present in both males and females. However, it's the males that showcase larger horns which can grow to an impressive size ranging from 24 to 44 inches. They have a hump on their shoulders, which is especially bigger and prominent in adult males. In addition, they have a distinct dewlap of skin, stretching from their throat to their forelegs, which is visibly large in males. Hooves are pointed and pale in color. This physical prowess grants them the ability to navigate and maintain a firm grip on uneven terrains with remarkable ease. Acknowledged as the largest herbivore within its family, the Indian gore can attain an impressive size of up to 88 inches in height and weigh in excess of 1,000 kilograms. In their full-grown state, gores display a dark brown or blackish skin colour, whereas females and youngs exhibit a more reddish-brown and brown skin tone. They are sociable animals, gather into herds, containing 8 to 11 or more individuals. A gore herd includes females and one dominant male. The home range of each herd covers about 78 square kilometers or 30 square miles territory. Bulls often congregate into bachelor herds, while older males occasionally prefer living solitarily. Gore have a polygynous mating system where one male mates with a number of females. They breed all year round with a peak period, lasting from December to June. Female gores usually have an interval of 12 to 15 months between births. The gestation period lasts about 270 to 280 days, yielding a single baby. A newborn gore calf weighs 23 kilograms on average. At the age of nine months, the calf is weaned and becomes reproductively mature when it is two to three years old. <laughs> 